Hello everybody! In this video I'll show you how to display and change file extensions in Windows 7, 8 and 10. Dear friends, if you need to recover deleted data, use Utilities by Hetman Software. Follow the link in the description to visit our website, download a utility for free and install it. Then start disk analysis. When the process is over, it will show the files available for recovery, and you will be able to bring them back. Our blog features quick guides to solve all kinds of problems faced by Windows users. Our channel and blog offer solutions for any issues, from installing the operating system to remote administration and connecting mobile devices. Our specialists will be glad to answer your questions in comments to videos and articles. By default, Windows doesn't show file extensions. It is not always convenient, as sometimes you need to change the extension or just see it. Files with different extensions may have similarly looking icons, and what is more, there are viruses, the spreading of which depends on whether file extensions are displayed or not. Follow the link to our channel in the description to watch a video on how to delete a Trojan virus, a keylogger virus, or any other kind of virus or malware from your computer. To display file extensions in Windows 7, go to Control Panel, Folder Options, View. Find the item Hide extensions for known file types and uncheck the box next to it. Apply. OK, and after that all file extensions will be displayed in your computer. This method also works in Windows 8 and 10, but in Control Panel you should choose File Explorer options instead of Folder options. In Windows 8 and 10, you can open File Explorer Options menu from the File Manager as well. To do it, open any folder, select File, change folder and search locations. Then uncheck the box next to the item we have already mentioned. Or select View, Options, Change Folder and Search Options, and go on as before. In Windows 8 and 10, there is an easier way to choose to display or hide file extensions without using Folder Options menu. To do it, open any folder, go to the tab View, choose Show – Hide, and check the box next to the item File Name Extensions. When I check or uncheck the box, you can see file extensions appear and disappear. It's easy. Now there is no problem to display extensions. Yet sometimes you need to change file extensions. How can you do that? If we are talking about changing extension of a file with both extensions, the current one and the one you want the file to have, created by one and the same application, this operation can be done with such application. In plain English, it means save it with another extension. For example, there is a docx file and we need to change its extension into rtf. Microsoft Word supports both file extensions. To change the extension, open the file with Microsoft Word, choose File – Save as – Browse. In the menu Save as type, you can choose the extension to save the file. Find RTF on the list, save. As you can see, now there is the same file but with a different extension. To change the extension manually, or if your computer doesn't have the application to read or save the file, right-click on the file you need and select Rename. Or select the file you need and press the key F2. After that, delete the unnecessary extension manually and add the extension you want. After you press Enter, the system will warn you that after changing extension the file may become inaccessible. Confirm your decision to change extension. And even if the file cannot be read after your actions, you can change its extension back in the same way. If for some reason you need to change extensions for several files of certain format in one folder at the same time, you can do it with the help of command prompt. Find the link to the video about command prompt in the description. To do it, uh, go to the folder containing the files, the extensions of which you need to change. Type cmd in the address bar and press Enter. Type in the command prompt ren docx.txt. 
if you want to change docx files into txt files. As you can see, extensions of all docx files have now become txt files. That is all for now. If you like this video, click the like button below and subscribe to our channel to see more. Thank you for watching and good luck!